Gotta make sure I put the whole team on Everyone got Mike and Mary jeans on To some shots in the dark with no beam on To some L's I had no one Previously on Jack TV Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV Me and the team flew to Miami to play Easy Boy What's good, YT? Your boy, YS, the artist I haven't really with our for reaction. Cheating, but Subscribe, like, comment, baby You already know, man, we back here with another loyalty test, you heard? Yeah, that's what I said Shout out Jack TV, man, it's been a minute since I did one of these, man Let's find out now Is Shorty loyal? Supposedly today we're going to see if the girlfriend is going to cheat with the day one. That's the day one right there. Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. Okay. Sean put his girlfriend to a loyalty test because he feels she is taking a liking to his homie who trains her in the gym and their relationship is Ooh. starting to make him feel uncomfortable. You know what I mean? Supposedly though, day one is, is the personal trainer. Now it seems like she's just booking a lot, a lot more sessions with him. And, 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 and the homie right here thinks Shorty's feeling a friend. She want to book him all, all week. She trying to get in the gym all week. Y'all think she really just trying to get in the gym? Or, or y'all think she just trying to get in the gym? You know what I mean? <laughs> you know, the homeboy, come on now. At the end of the day, you know... He, he got to understand it like, yo, what shorties be like when they trying to chose up. So if you a gym instructor and shorty want to book mad sessions and it's like, you got to have an idea of something going on. Sean had already briefed me on this information, which is why we chose the day that Ariel requested for the session to be at her apartment gym to conduct this test. Since we have all the information ahead of time, it was pretty simple for myself and the team to get inside the apartment gym and set up the cameras. After See, that, that boy, that boy Jack and I'm going to recon, going in, put the cameras up, get, get the vibes, capture the scene. I mean, one thing, one thing I don't be understanding about these loyalty testers is like, yo, bro, I'm like a straightforward type dude, man. I'll be honest, man. I don't like, care how much I love a shorty, bro. Y'all you heard it here first, bro. And I'm your partner. If I feel like you being this and loyal, I ask you, I mean, I'm done like, with you. Hey, fool, you we we might have kids. We yeah, got right. kids. I'm, I'm sorry. I still got to be done with you because I can't put up with no disloyalty. It's like, it's like... We'll it's like it's no going back from this loyalty. You get what I'm saying? Like, Let's find out now even if you stay with the shorty, bro, you're still gonna have second thoughts of. Uh, Website is a free app that you can download that help you get cash it. back on everyday essentials like Always gas down at the groceries. I'm you know, utilizing the gas option right so now, why, which why is pretty easy that? to do. They you know have over a hundred thousand gas it's options that ensure you can use here, upside bro. at pretty and, uh, much any gas station you go to. And get if cash back on every gallon of gas that you put in your car, you? which is cash that will be deposited directly into your bank account. For you it's really do. simple. Open your upside app. It knows uh, where I'm at, so it knows I'm at this gas station. Let me go ahead and hit claim. Trust. And trust that's is it. A, Some of the top earners on Upside are like, getting over $1,000 every like single month. So find out how much you guys can earn. Soul, Hit the link in my mean? description to download Upside for free today or scan the QR code that's on the screen. The first two broken, times you fill up with gas, you'll get an additional 25 cents off every single gallon. It ain't no fishing it. Like a trophy. Look at trust like a trophy, bro. Once you break a trophy, it's not the same when you put it back together. You feel me? It's just it's blemishes and all that. So... If, if y'all in a relationship, man, it's not enough trust in a relationship, bro. It's like, listen, bro, get up out of there. You know how many women is out here lonely and, and, and ready to 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 to, to 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 get swooped up by a guy who they going to give everything to instead of dealing with somebody that is loyal? Y'all tripping, bro. Y'all be tripping. And I be feeling like people do that because they be scared to, to start with, with a new person. But I look at it like y'all tripping. At the end of the day, who cares if you're comfortable right here? It's all about being uncomfortable in life. You know, homie, homie been his friend for 11 years. You know, him him and dude probably got a real good, solid relationship. He trusts bro. But then at the end of the day, it's like, you know, his girl probably saw that and could have been jealous and been trying to break that friendship up because... I mean, why why get attracted to the personal trainer that's your your man's best friend? That's weird. 
Shorty, Shorty could have went and smashed another nigga in the gym. She trying to smash her man best friend. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to step up, okay? Low key, this nigga look like gunners. Like, they got gunner in his gym. Gunner had the, the, uh, the blonde head. <laughs> I didn't hit Gunner. <laughs> that boy got her doing the step ups for the glutes. You know what I mean? Specifically, that that right there is a glute workout. I mean, what if we were low key greasing already, like on the low? The just way of saying that is just, you know what I mean? On the side. I'm sure being a personal trainer is difficult though, man, because you got a lot of women out there that, that probably get in the gym and they're insecure about their body. And and then they might get attached to somebody that's trying to boost them on a confidence level, you know what I mean? Like, your personal trainer ain't supposed to be mean to you. He's supposed to be nice. He's supposed to motivate you. So, like, women don't know the, the, the line between professionalism and... and uh, uh, shooting a shot sometimes, like sometimes you could just be being professional with a girl, and then she takes that as you liking her back or something. So that might be the case in this situation, bro. You know, at the end of the day, she can't be mad at her man for trying to get some money, cause. Let's be realistic. If if he was a broke nigga, she wouldn't rock with him. So, it's really no win, no way to win with these new new age girls, bro. I'm gonna be honest, cause there's two things they require you to have, bro. They they really most of the time they want all of your time, but then you can't be broke. So, how can you want somebody's all of somebody's time, but you be mad that they're focused on making money, and for the guys who are working hard doing a nine to five, you know, your girl at the house bored getting getting greased. And when when you find out, like, man, babe, why you were cheating on me? She's gonna say, You didn't have enough time for me. Like, so it's like, yo, bro, I ain't gonna lie, you just gotta knock these hoes down till you meet that that solid female that like understands, okay, my man has to go make money. There's gonna be time that I'm gonna have with my man, but I'm not gonna require all his time. Or if he's working a nine to five all day, I need to stay busy and have a hobby instead of being at home bored. Once you find that, bro, you good. But a lot of these joints is like, yo, bro, they want all your time. They need all your money. And you hear this one saying she don't care about money because she want all his time. See? She she's literally complimenting dude right here, like, oh, I appreciate you being here, not doing no work in the house. And and like I just said, you heard the homeboy say he trying to make sure y'all good. So, you boosting up a man who 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 not making sure you good. And you can you, honestly you, tell that she feels comfortable enough to vent to Leah about right. Tishon and her relationship. But do you guys consider this a red flag? Your it is a red flag, Jack. Fighting in his or her best friend because, about problems with because the Because there's no real problem. problem. Below, She's making it seem think? like her man is too busy trying to make sure they're good and he doesn't have enough time for her. But the boyfriend is, is the, the best friend is, is literally telling her, like, yo, bro, if he's not working and making sure y'all good, how else y'all going to be having money? She's like, I don't care about money. And that's not that's not the case at all, bro. That's a lie. It's the fact that she doesn't feel in control of of homeboy's time. He probably a busy guy. He probably got a lot of moves. You know, she got a decent little body, bro. But it ain't nothing that's like, oh, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta be here for a lifetime. It ain't nothing like that, man. You, I hope, I hope, I wish, wish a lot of dudes would look at it different. Like when it come to these hoes, bro, it's too many of them, bro. <laughs> like literally, fam, it's, bro, it's a million women that's alone right now, waiting on any guy, bro. And women don't like to be alone. They're, they're desperate. They don't, they don't like to be alone. Like that's not how they made to be alone. Like they don't like to be alone. 
they want to have a companion. Right. You know what I mean? They they want somebody to 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 give them their time. So if you dealing with a shorty like this and you can't trust her, bro, get up out of there. You got you got millions of other women that's like they don't want a hundred percent of your time. They only probably want like twenty five. You know what I mean? Shorty acting like she want a hundred percent of buddy time, and then she's so foul. She want to go smash his homeboy. She could have smashed anybody. Tell him, bro, she be seeing him side eye her. But you the one booking all the sessions, though. Right, that's why he asking you ain't feeling me at all. Like, be be real. You booking mad sessions with your boy. You gotta be feeling me. Curtains, broski. Fam, mm -hmm. it's curtains. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that was hard to watch. That was my hard to watch. On shoes and I was his best friend. I just don't think I would have took it that far. But once again, comment down below what you guys think. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think Buddy probably smashed that already. But that's just my opinion. Cause, cause Shuddy was just too comfortable off rips. You know, like. Sean had seen enough, and this was a good time to stop it, in my opinion. Yeah, before before it happened. Happened. Blow it up, blow it up, Hunter. What's up? The the What's gonna happen? Stay tuned for more. It's about to go down. This really be my favorite part hey of the loyalty test. Before we get back into the loyalty test, I just want to show you guys the app I mentioned earlier actually works. I've made over five hundred dollars in the last few months using it. So if you guys want to earn easy extra cash, all you gotta do is click the link in my description or scan the QR code. Y'all make sure y'all get on that screen. app, man. That Jack telling y'all about, man. Y'all boys get out there, man. Get, get them extra the points, the rewards. Mmm. Look. 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 She embarrassed. She embarrassed. So, so even if you said he was messing with multiple women, why go behind his back to, to smash his homie? You could have left, shorty. You got to get up out of here, girl. It's over. She talking about you got to be mad at your homeboy. <laughs> she, thought, she thought she was, like I said, putting two guys against each other, bro. It, it was just a manipulated move. And she told him, she like, you got to get mad at your homeboy. Whole time thinking he was going to switch up on her. And it's like, nah. The homeboy knew everything that was going on. See, look, she salty. She salty because she, she thought dude was going to fight dude over her. But it's not like that. I'm not 
Right, he got you. She was just popping all this, and it's like, shorty, you you don't even own this spot apparently. You was doing it for the cameras. But did y'all do anything? Bro, shorty, <laughs> shorty in denial right now. <laughs> Look, you trying to convince the friend that he like you for real, and it's like shorty. He not, he not jacking you like that. He with his man. He's he riding point, with his homie. Area was saying is true or not, and then she's saying these things out of spite. However, in her going on with her rent, feeling that everything was mutual between Lee and her, he not once said anything to defend himself, nor did he deny that the things were mutual between the two of them. Instead, he just kind of stayed quiet. He could possibly be a non confrontational individual, but I think those allegations definitely deserve a conversation between him and Tayshawn. Right, we gotta talk about that to see if he was slam ball. Based on what Ariel is saying, do you guys feel like Lee is feeling her outside of the test? Let me know down in the comments below. I don't know. I feel like homie right here got to get some new friends, though, man. Because, yeah, you know I mean, your, your girl shouldn't be trying to say she, she, both y'all feeling each other, your, your mans and her feeling each other. Dude right here cool as ever, man. But I feel like he already know the play. He more of a calculated type guy, man. Listen, y'all gotta get up out of there. There's no trust. There's no trust, buddy. It's no point of being there and going through all that, man. Y'all subscribe, like, till next time, you heard? But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Can't trust him. These hoes ain't loyal.